Tonight we're introducing you to our Boys and Girls High School Basketball Players of the Year. More accurately, we're reintroducing you. We spend a lot of time this year hearing from both stars and seeing their highlights during the season. So let's start on the boys' side where three top players grabbed most of the headlines this year, but in the end, one stood above the field. Justin Barney now with Paxton's Isaiah Adams, our Boys High School Basketball Player of the Year. I like to be more of a playmaker and like make plays for other people rather than, I guess, score the ball. But I try to, I just want to do whatever I can to win the basketball game. So that's basically the whole thing is to win. That's what I want to do. Did Mr. Basketball and, and the playoff success that you had take you by surprise or did you expect stuff like that? I, I kind of, I expected um, after our last year going to the Final Four, I expected us to make a push and do it again this year. The Mr. Basketball, that was kind of, I was, I, before the season started, I was like, okay, um, I'm going to try and win it again this year, or try and win it this year. Uh, come, I came in like third last year uh, to like Vernon Carey and stuff like that. But um, this year I came in, okay, um, as, the, as the year ends, I'll go in trying to win Mr. Basketball. But first I got to win basketball games and stuff like that. So as as the season went on and stuff like that, um, I kind of, kind of got more towards okay, what am I, how am I shaping up to win Mr. Basketball? And once they came out with the Player of the Year, I went now okay, I got a pretty good chance now. I got a pretty good chance. So I started to keep up, see all the players that won, um, that won Player of the Year in their classes. And I'm like, okay, okay. So then when it came out, I was like, all right, bet, bet, I got it, I got it this year. What do you remember most about high school? Um. As far as playing with the team, the the the, the chemistry that we had together.